Hello, I am the Ronin Pawn, and this is Subnautica. Welcome back to it, everybody. I am putting my Let's Play of Subnautica on hold just for today. Okay, it'll be back just for today so we can take a look at the new features in the H2.0 update that just came down yesterday for Subnautica. So let's jump in in survival mode because that's just what I like to play and, uh, and give it a go. First update I'm noticing, the Aurora got lighter. The Aurora was struck by a mysterious energy pulse, resulting in catastrophic hull failure. Did the energy pulse smell like fish? I have an idea who caused this. You were in that life pod. No, I wasn't. It was someone else. It's not my fault, Captain. Welcome to the brand new Subnautica with a whole new set of lighting features and apparently water generation. Who wants to take a look? This ladder looks different straight off. Who wants to take a look? Look at the new water and the atmospheric effects. There was not a sense of distance. There was definitely a sense of distance and scale before, but this is new. Look at that beautiful blue water and you can't quite see through. Whoa, I stepped right off the thing. All right, so the first of the updates is a massive visual overhaul. I'm noticing a lot more shine to a lot of things just in here. And yeah, the, the ladder looks Brilliant. Good work on the ladder, devs. Look at the fabricator with its nice metallic shine. Let's pop her open. There is a new handheld scanner device in this game that I have to have right now. The scanner. A handheld electric with the scanning for the atomic level of the targeted. Yes. Two titanium and a battery. Okay, let's go get the uh, the supplies we're gonna need. For a battery, boom, boom, boom. I'm gonna need some mushrooms, acid. increased local radiation levels. Yeah, continue to monitor the Aurora while I explore this beautiful, beautiful new world with all the new lighting and, and also the frame rate. Hang on, it's just loading it for the first time. Oh, quartzy quartz quartz. Look at the, just everything looks so much better. Aha, aha, limestone. Break you, get me some copper. I'm gonna need at least one more of those for my battery so we can get the brand new scanner in the game. Look at in the dark areas with the lighting effect of the and things that are making it brighter and you guys are all over the place now. That's that's creepy. Get away from me with your eyeball sack thing. I feel lost. I feel I got spun around and I'm down to 12 12 oxygen. Come on, back Emergency. to the surface. Back to the I know. I heard. Oxygen Thank remaining. you. I heard before you said. Oh. Hey. There's a giant moon. Did anybody notice that before me? I was looking at some other things. Oh crap, oh crap, where are you? Oh, Jesus, hell, I was listening to the lady. She was telling me things. Yeah, the core, my core has been breached. Thank you, right in the rectum too. I was swimming away when he popped. Ooh, looky here, we got some doodly-doos. Some sea moth fragments that, can I not pick it up? I can't pick it up. Aha, you can no longer collect the fragments because you need the scanner device to scan them and then they will tell you about the <laughs> Told you there were new features, didn't I say something about there being new features? Get me some copper so I can show everybody. Or you could just play in the creative mode. No, I don't, I wanna play with in this mode. Look at, just look at that. Just look at that with the green hues and the light god rays that are shimmering down onto my beautiful sexy fish. It's not me, it's the fish that are sexy. Be copper, don't be bites of titanium. Nobody likes titanium. Eats, you eat something. I found titanium. Oh, but did you see that? Did you see that? I will show it to you if you didn't see it. Watch this. Look, titanium, it's got its own texture now. And when I drop it, it's a thing. It's a 3D model, it's a big globule of it's, uh, it's like something I, I have a lot of things in my throat that look like that. Oh wow, look at as the sun goes down and it turns all greeny and spooky. We have been dumping some industrial waste since the Aurora cla crash, but I don't think that's the cause of this. More titanium, don't need your titanium, need your copper. Show me cop, no, it's titanium. Come on, copper. That's copper ore. Okay, I think I got everything that I need now in order to make the, hang on, let me just grab 92 more things. Oh, it's getting dark, the end of day one, ladies and gentlemen, look at this. Look at just how dark. Wow, and look at how gorgeous it is with the purples and the blues and the blues and the purples and the blacks and the darknesses. It was already a beautiful game. Why did you even bother? Thank you for bothering. And the water, and the water comes in a water bottle. That looks a little bit different than it used to. What? Detonation will occur with a probability huh? of 85.5. I missed the first part. Are we having a party? Is there going to be cake? There has been a massive number of new 3D models put into the game in this update. So where we're used to seeing just like little cubes um, that were supposed to represent the object. Now there's actual objects for a lot of this stuff, including, look at the copper wire, the computer chip, the wiring kits. Let's see what glass looks like. 
That wasn't glass. I, I meant to flush. And rubber? It's a roll of rubber. Cool. Titanium, a big old chunk of titanium, yeah. That also probably needs to be flushed. Let's have a survival knife. The knife has been an essential tool of the human race for approximately two and a half million years. It is recommended that you look after this one. Hey, hey, hey. My religion is wrong. You're right, two and a half million, at least. Up the ladder. Oh my god. Look at this at the middle of the night and the moon passing so... Oh, Jesus, how what? Suggest a quantum detonation has occurred in the Aurora's drive what? No, the I was just looking at the moon. Reactor will reach a super critical state. Ten, no, nine, no, this is eight, too early. The moon seven, is right over it. Six, it's gonna, it's gonna cause five, a massive critical. It's gonna knock the moon out of orbit. Eight, Haven't you seen Dragon Ball? This happens. Oh crap. Sorry, moon. So, uh, the Aurora still explodes in the new update. But I can't be bothered with little things like quantum nuclear meltdown. I've got one of these! Look! Look, everybody! How am I gonna do the rest of the video leaning over here? No, it's fine. I'll just lean. <laughs> we now have a scanner with which to scan. Err. Um, what can I scan? Uh, bring me a boomerang fish. Pointing it generally in the boomerang's direction is doing something ready to scan. Oh, no, I do have to scan. Okay. You right click and then... New encyclopedia data added! Cool! So now you can catch them all! Okay, mom! You can go around and actually, like, create a database of information on all your favorite fishies and possibly other things in the game. Where are you going, Peeper? God, the Peepers are gonna be horrible for this. Peeper! Peeper, don't don't run from me, Peeper! I'm trying to scan your, you know, inners. I'm, I, you may have a disease that you're not aware of. I will tell you if you'll just let me finish my scan. Yeah, there we go. Peeper, done. Can I scan you without getting close enough that you attack me? Is that a possibility? I know. I'm just, I'm just chatting with him. I'm just talking to see if we can maybe like, no, 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 scan him. Scan him, scan him before he pops. No, you, why did you wait until you got close to me? Oh, okay. The scanner may have been damaged by my scannering. Ooh, crash home. I can scan where he, is, where he lives though, and I can also suffocate while I'm doing so. I've only got three seconds. I gotta go. I gotta go. I gotta go. Up, 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 uh, do you mind, Gasopod? I just need to get a little bit of a scan here. I'm trying to figure out why you're so gassy, oh potty. I'm gonna help you with your dietary regimen if you'll just let me- f Oh crap, I'm running out of oxygen again. Fine. Okay, quit pooping everywhere. Please, for the love of. I'm trying to scan you. Thank you. Welcome to my database. Aha! Here are those sea moth fragments we found before. Okay, get out my scanner because this l works a whole new way. You don't collect the fragments anymore, you scan them. And then by scanning them, you get a blueprint of the thing and then I don't know how this works. It's my first time doing it. Uh, ah, 20%! 20% of progress has been made, so I have to scan um, uh, many of them. So you have to find five of everything that you need, and then maybe something along those lines. Cool! I like it. And as I just keep taking injuries, everyone, we get to see what the bleach container looks like. I told them to put caution labels on the bleach. They, they listen to me. Or they just are, like, reasonable human beings. Patch me up if you don't mind. I'm gonna need a med kit. Might as well have an oxygen tank while we're here. And a nice band-aid for me. There we go, back up to 85% health. Could use some food and water. Nah, I'll be fine. Ah, I really, really like the look of this guy. I liked the look of the game before, but you, you managed to one-up yourselves. Congratulations, devs. And just look at it. Just hands off, just look at it. Just swim through the world. Under the sea, under the sea. Darling, it's better down where it's wetter. Take it from me. Ooh, something I really want to do. I want to see if there's any information about this little floaty guy. Because he's been... It's Rabbit Ray! I didn't even know your name before. Because you didn't have one before, I don't think. Rabbit Ray, tell me, tell me everything about you. The scanner adds a whole new layer to this game. And wow, look at how dark it is now. I, honest to God, can't really see where I'm going. Especially with all the lights 
that I've got on for the green screen to work. Oh, hi! I'm still trying to get a scan of you, if you wouldn't mind. I've got another way to do this, though. Come on, come get me. It, oh, man. Oh, man. Come on, come on. Yeah, no, okay, I'm just gonna scan his blood really quickly. Come on, give me the, give me the blood scan. Blood scan, no. Okay, Ten emergency. Seconds Ten oxygen. seconds of oxygen. That wasn't the exit. That wasn't the exit. Here's the exit. Here's the exit. Go, go to the moon. Go to the, oh my god, look at the moon. Look at the moon through the water from depth. Oh, if, if you survive it. Yeah! There's another moon! There's a second moon! There's two moon! Well, that may, may not be a moon. That may be like a sister planet. But there's a moon, too! And it looks like our moon. Look at how beautiful the life pod looks! Jesus, developers, what are you doing? Just wasting your time making this thing gorgeous. Keep wasting your time. It's good. It's good. Before the night is out, though, I kind of want to see what happens in terms of lighting when I drop, say, a flare into a rather dark place. For example, this crevasse over here. Gink. <laughs> and he saw it, and it was good! Look at this! Oh yeah, oh yeah, here's my flare. Here she is. Um, don't dig the sand, pick up the flare. Wow, the lighting effects. Morning. And look at this! Look at this! Remaining. What am I doing? I'm looking at my my own like air bubble through the light as the, through the light of the moon. I don't know what that is actually. I don't think that's supposed to be there. I may have identified a small glitch uh, having to do with the flares. There is also a new addition to Subnautica. You have a small sprite friend who comes around with you and follows you and generates light wherever you go. Well, farting a little bit. What is the eye button? There's an eye, the eye keeps popping up. Oh, is that when I'm looking at something that I can potentially scan? Ah, I can even scan metal salvage, like I needed to know about metal salvage. You know what it is? It's metal that you salvage. Sunrise, sunrise is coming. Come, come little sprite friend. Let's watch the sunrise. Boy, it looks just like sunrise on the sea too. You know, there's that sort of dirty stage of sunrise where it's kind of, the sepia tone, and then just a few seconds later, and it's God's kingdom of magnificence. Hello, I need to scan you. Oh God, he doesn't like being scanned. He does not like being scanned. Listen, it, it'll only hurt the one time. Yeah, just wriggle a little bit into that wall. It's a good idea. Don't run from me. My scanner is, I know there's a little bit of radiation going into your, I did it. I got him. Hey, 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 that's my titanium. Let go of the salvage. Oh crap, I, I might have pissed him off. I may have pissed him off. He is, well, he is really interested in that metal salvage. It's mine. And my sprite friend. It's, it's ours. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to leave you out, little sprightly. Look at the creep fine biome. Look at how green and nasty it looks. Just like it should. Just like it should. Yeah, let's go into the green, creepy, nasty space. Uh, are you up for it, little sprite? Yeah, he's good. I'll bet I can scan the sandstone too. Sandstone chunk, which means this is gonna contain either gold or silver or God knows anything else. Boom. Oh, Jesus, not with my scanner. And also don't fall into the wall. I needed that. I needed it. Where did it go? Dig for it. Did you do that? Did you do that? You little, I thought we were friends. Apparently he's just hovering over my shoulder to screw with me. If I understand this right, now that I've scanned a bunch of things, if I go over to the data bank, and go over to alien life forms, we're looking for fauna, then herbivores, air sac. You now have entire pages of information on each of the things that you've scanned. Tell me about the gasopods. A slow moving life form capable of filling the water with a poisonous and corrosive compound capable of dissolving even synthetic fibers. I've smelled that while I was diving. Tell you what though, if I'm gonna show you guys even half of the cool things in the new release of Subnautica, I'm gonna need to cheat. <laughs> yes, I'll have a sea glide for free and a mobile vehicle bay. Go vehicle bay! Yeah, this is a lot easier than the last time I, I made a submarine in the game. Let's have a sea moth, I think, would be a good idea. Yeah, one of those. Just uh, just go build it there. You want to give him a hand there, Mr. Uh, Mr. Sprightly Pixel Friend? And this may not go well, but right on top of the sea moth, how about a giant submarine? <laughs> Look out, sea moth! And I may need another sea moth. Anybody see a sea moth around here? I just know I had one. Pretty sure that I put one right. Oh, there it is. Yeah, you know what? We don't need the sea moth. We'll be fine. Yeah, it's a little shallow in these parts. Okay, no, it's fine. I'm just all right. Yeah, no, I just I'm not the best parallel parker. Oh yeah, right. Yeah, just a little bit on. I need curb feelers, is what I need. 
Look at that. You see the little, um, the little sea moth fragment, or, you know, it could be any kind of fragment. As I'm driving here, I'm just realizing how awesome a mechanic it is now that you have to go out and find them and then scan a certain collection of the fragments in order to get to the next place. Before, you could just find one and pop it into a scanner thing, and then it would just take care of itself. This is so much better. Um, radiation detected. Surely I'm shielded from the radiation, right? I'm not shielded from the radiation. Okay, no, but I can be. I can be in just a... Oh crap, I don't have a... I don't have any of the things that I need. Oh, um, okay, just back away. Back away slowly. We just entered the radiation detected. We don't... we don't need to be here. We'll be fine. We'll be fine, don't, won't we, sprite friend? Shoot, who knew cheating could work out so poorly? I don't have a builder. And I'm very far away from the nearest fabricator. There we go. Now I've got a builder. What the hell was that? Did everybody... Um, cheating is bad. Okay, I don't know what just happened, but I've got the builder in my hand and that's really all that matters. Give me a fabricator on the wall at crotch level. I know, that's why I'm about to pull a Jesus and magic up some food. And from one fish he cut many and all were fed. Okay, I'm gonna need a radiation suit if we're going to proceed with the video. Might as well have some fins while we're at it. I mean, you know, as long as it's free. Carry on toward the Aurora. What am I stuck on? Am I hitting the... I, I'm grounding out a little bit. Engine room. We seem to be jammed on something. Could you just get out and maybe take a crowbar? Okay, what exactly are we caught up on? Huh? Oh, hi. Oh, God. What, the, what was that? What was that? Huh? Who wants some? I've got 18% health. Don't, don't. I don't want any from you. What am I stuck on? I'm not stuck on anything. I think it's because I did the mad loot on the inside of the submarine, and now we don't have a submarine. One more mobile vehicle bay will solve this problem for us. There we go. Okay, uh, just need a sea moth this time, and I won't crush it with the other bigger ship. In fact, here, I'll catch it. I'll catch it. Go ahead and drop it. I got it! Ow. Yeah, that's better. Okay, where is the Aurora? It's off in this direction. Perfect. Hello, Aurora! I've made it to you, and I've got the sea moth, so we should be fine. What's that sound? Seriously, what is that sound? Hello? Um, strike, short, health diminishing, shoot it, shoot it, um, attack it, do something. No, no, you can have it, you can have it. Thank you, thank you very much. Um, just want to get a quick scan in on this guy. Excuse me. Uh-oh. Um, I think, I think he's gonna, yeah, you know what? You can keep the hole. You can, oh god, he's come for me, he's come for me. We may have to look at the other features of Subnautica next time on Rodan Poland's Subnautica Let's Play on YouTube. Goodbye, everybody! Goodbye! Welcome aboard, Captain. Did he find me here, too?